all right welcome to another section on the um Toam academy so on wordpress 101 which is a beginner friendly guide to learning wordpress so today we are going to be taking a look at the benefits of using wordpress and in this section we are going to be looking at the popularity of wordpress the community aspect the extensions and some other uh, benefits of using wordpress so first we start the popularity so as you can see on this screen wordpress powers 40% of all websites on the internet. That is, if you are to collect all the websites on the internet, WordPress powers 40% of all the websites. And if you keep compare that percentage to the rest of the CMS, such as the Joomla, Drupal, Squarespace, and Wix, you can see that the highest is Joomla, which uh, powers 2.6% of all websites. Compared to the 40 percentage of WordPress, so that is a very uh, a, a kind of a large uh, a, a large number and a huge gap and when we are looking at the CMS market WordPress has a 64% CMS market share compared to Joomla having 4.6% to Drupal having 3.0% compared to Squarespace having 2.7% and compared to Wix having 2.3% and in order not to bore you with all this uh, figure because I know some of, some of us might not actually be uh, okay with something you know with something like figures so i'm going to be uh showing you another examples a, a kind of a friendly example so on this screen so we have uh they said 62 percent according to uh the time in which they have this article is posted which is the uh on the october 2nd of october 2021 so 62 percent of the top 100 fastest growing companies in the u.s use wordpress so that is when you are counting on the fastest growing companies in the us 62 percent of these companies are using wordpress and over 500 new websites are created daily using the free fashion of wordpress so yeah, i'm still going to share you this link so that you can read the article and know a lot about the percentage of websites that are using wordpress but one thing that i also want to bring out is that as at the time of making this tutorial video there are currently over 455 million websites that use wordpress so if something is uh if, if you have a software that is being used by a lot of people so that shows that the wordpress the software is a very good software because if something is not quite good or if something is uh, uh it has a bug or it's, it's complicated to use so it wouldn't have had so much of that large user uh, base so that's why uh, that's the benefit of uh, the, the using wordpress in the terms of popularity but moving on to the next aspect is the community aspect so if you are to start learning a skill a tool or a software one thing that you really have to consider is the community because let's say you are trying to learn a skill or a software if you have issue who would you run to? Who would help you to navigate your way through the issue? So WordPress has a uh, each community. Uh, we have the WordPress Nigeria. We have the WordPress. Um, WordPress is in over 817 cities worldwide. And there are hundreds of thousands of developers, content creators, designers, site owners that meet every month in these uh, cities worldwide. So if you have issue, let's say you are trying to fix something on your website or you are trying to come up with something but you couldn't fix it so you can easily post your issue in this community and someone will definitely answer you on the issue so that's the benefit of using wordpress at the end of this video or before the end of this course i'm also going to be sharing you some communities that you need to join so that if you have issue when trying to be the website you can easily post your issue in this um community and you get your answer to it so we've talked about the popularity we've talked about the community now we are moving on to another part which is the extensions aspect so extension is what makes wordpress a robust software for instance if you want to build a uh, social network website like facebook or you want to build a forum website or you want to build an e-commerce website like jumia so the extension is what will determines what kind of website you want to build with your website so with wordpress you have access to 59,051 free plugins that you can use to extend the functionality of your website and seen on this page you see something like 
pricing table you see sticky block for Kotenberg so these are actually block enable plugins and you can also see featured plugins and you can see better plugins and etc so as we move on and progress with this course I will show you more on how you can use this plugin to extend the functionality of your website so lastly we are going to be taking a look at um, some of the 